in this video. Interesting facts about old capital of Norway and also let's walk around together. Hi, hi guys, your favorite Russian British vlogger is here and today we are in old Norwegian capital and it's not Oslo as you might think it's Tongsberg because before Oslo the capital of this country used to be Tongsberg and in this video I'm gonna show you around I don't have any specific plans so we'll just go with the flow but of course I cannot leave you without some interesting facts about this historical place. Looking for something old or something new? Explore one of Scandinavia's oldest cities on a different kind of day trip from Oslo. Welcome to Tongsberg, guys. Tongsberg is generally regarded as the oldest city in Norway. It was founded by Vikings in the 9th century. The town was destroyed by fire in 1536 and only in the 18th and 19th centuries did it become a major port and one of Norway's major shipping and whaling centers. Until the late 1960s it was Norway's third largest maritime town Tongsburg reminds an industrial and shipping center with such diverse concerns as metal shops, shipyards, paper mink mills, leather processing and breweries. It is noted especially for its silverware. Tongsberg, or historically Tungsberg, is a city and also a municipality in Westfold or Telemark County, located 102 kilometers or 63 miles south southwest from Oslo. Kongsberg in numbers, 102 kilometers from Oslo, an actual capital of Norway, 48,350 people living in Tongsberg city, split between Tongsberg and Noteroy municipalities, 20.8% increase of population from 2000 to 2015. As a bonus to car-free international visitors, the city is easy to reach on a day trip from Oslo by train, or by bus. Here a few things to see and to do while you are in town. Oh, how I wish for the Christmas One of the famous parts of Tongsberg is Tongsberg Marina. Summertime it would be parked with people and the boats, but now it's like literally almost no one here. And still it doesn't stop you from having a lovely walk in this marina, breathing some sea air. say I was so lucky with the weather today. Sun is shining, it's December time and I don't even need to wear my gloves. When people from Tongsburg say Brigga, this is the harbor they actually mean. This harbor is popular for its active nightlife, especially summer months, and also its eating and drinking. And actually lots of people from Oslo spending their time here enjoying this Tongsberg Marina. Summertime it's a perfect place to enjoy your ice cream or some fresh seafood but in December it's all closed. Guys this is really interesting I'm taking a walk in Tongsberg Marina and all the restaurants are closed. If you know anything about it please drop me a comment if they just don't work on Friday at 2 p.m. or is due to current global situation. Definitely something old and something new. Now we're back here once again. Tongsberg is Norway's oldest city. It actually dates back to the Viking era. By the Tongsberg harbor, you can travel back in time at Viking Garden and experience a true size reconstruction of the legendary Osberg Viking ship. You may try sailing a Viking longship too, if you dare. Something old. 
and something new. The town is very significant because of the Oseberg ship, which is a Viking ship that was found in the ground in 1904. This is the ship from the Norwegian 20 Krone. The ship is known as a national treasure, which everyone likes. They took the ship to Oslo in the 20s and made it part of the Viking Ship Museum there. The ship was rebuilt in the 20s and the central bank put it on the 20 crown. Maybe not a coincidence. A replica of the Osberg ship stands in the Slotsfield Museum. This copy of Osberg ship was built exactly to the specifications of an original Viking ship, using the tools available in Viking era. Unfortunately, you cannot take the ride on this ship. The boat is taken out for sailing, only for special events. And this is probably one of the cutest things, one of the cutest things I've ever seen. And it's the petrol station right in the middle of Tonsberg and the World's End. Look how cool this is. That's BP petrol station. I have no idea how old it is, but it looks so cute. <laughs> Only 30 minutes away drive from Tongsburg, you have the world's end. This well-known tower making the site was built from stones from Tioma Beach more than 80 years ago. The scenic spot at the world's end, Verdens Ende, is situated at the southernmost tip of Tioma. Its unique lighthouse makes it a popular destination even when all elements of nature are in play. Verdens Ende, the world's end, is a part of a national park of Norway. It offers great ocean views, horse riding, <laughs> llama touching climbing and also tourist center. thing summer months it's packed with tourists and the locals and winter time it's quiet and relaxed not many people around but you can have still that fantastic walk this place is extremely beautiful another fantastic place to add to your travel list for the next time when you're coming to Norway the world's end what a perfect way to spend the evening and also enjoy this gorgeous sunset right from here. Guys, if you like this video, please don't forget to hit that like button. It will show the algorithm that this video is really cool and also I will be happy to see your feedback. Many famous Norwegians are calling Tongsburg city their home, including shipping magnate Wilhelm Wilhelmsen, former Liberal Party politician and Prime Minister of Norway Johan Sverdrup, Manchester United football player Ronnie Johansson and of course chess grassmaster Magnus Carlsen. Thank you so much guys for watching this video again. Thank you so much guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Can you think of any other city you would like me to show you in Norway? Please let me know in the comments down below. Stay safe, be happy and get ready to explore Norway together with me. I'll see you next week guys. Bye for now. Bye. Bye. Make